Over 143 million COVID-19 doses have been administered here in the U.S. As more and more Americans get their shots, many are wondering just how common it is for vaccinated people to get infected with the virus. And our chief health editor, Dr. Parthenandi, is joining us now to share data from two real-world studies. And, and Dr. Nandi, experts, I guess, are calling this breakthrough, breakthrough cases. What can you tell us about them? So, you know, the breakthrough cases are happening, and that's, uh, what does that mean, right? That means that a person who's been fully vaccinated, like myself, uh, who gets infected with the virus. And, and But don't let that scare you, because two real-world studies have shown that the risk overall is quite small. Now, the one study involved the University of Texas Southwestern Medical Center in Dallas, and over 8,000 employees participated. All were fully vaccinated, meaning that, you know, they, they got both doses if you're taking the Pfizer or the Moderna uh, vaccine. So how many of them ended up getting uh, uh, testing positive for COVID? Four people, just four. Now, the other study involved healthcare workers at two University of California campuses. Just over 14,800 of them were tested after receiving uh, both doses, and only 37%, 37 of them rather was uh, were tested positive. Overall, the researchers concluded that the estimate of testing positive was about 1% for these healthcare workers. So yes, breakthrough cases can happen, but are considered very rare. Pretty encouraging numbers there. And do we know what kind of symptoms they had? I mean, are the symptoms any less severe? And that's a key question, uh, Amira. So the California study did find that a few of the infected workers did develop symptoms, but they're very mild. And I'm not surprised because remember the studies that got these virus, uh, that these vaccines approved showed that breakthrough cases would be mild. In fact, some vaccinated people have no symptoms at all. They only discovered that they had the virus because of testing before medical procedures or testing in studies. So this shows the vaccines, guess what, are doing what they're supposed to do to keep you out of the hospital, number one, and then keep you out of the morgue as well. And, and so far, listen, so far so good. They're very effective in doing that. That's why I can't stress enough that how important it is for people to get vaccinated because it really is doing what it's supposed to. Yeah, we've been hearing a lot of concern as of late about the variants, specifically the UK variant uh, running rampant here in Michigan. To what extent do you think variants are playing a role in these breakthrough cases? Listen, I think it's possible, right, that, 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 that this is happening. We'll have more data very soon. The CDC is actually studying breakthrough cases to see if the variants are at the root cause. But to me, the takeaway is not to say, you know, wow, there are these breakthrough cases and the vaccines aren't working that great. It's not that's not the case. The vaccines do work, but how effective, you know, it's going to be, we'll find out with these variants. Uh, some of that really could be people, some of these breakthrough cases could be due to people having weaker immune responses, right? Also because of medications or illness, which interferes with the body's ability to build an immune response against the virus. But overall, those who are vaccinated, like myself, should feel safer knowing that, that you know, that, that they've, they've got been protected, but it's not ironclad. It's not 100 percent. And that's why people like myself who are fully vaccinated should still follow the pandemic precautions, wear a mask, avoid crowds and social distance from those who are not vaccinated. So you're going to get some breakthrough cases, but the vaccine is doing what it's supposed to. So please continue to get vaccinated and do the things you're supposed to until, you know, we get all, everybody else on board and vaccinated. I think that's how we get back to normal and beat the virus instead of concentrating every day on looking at the variants or, or, you know, we need to look at the surges, absolutely, but do our part, get vaccinated and stay protected. That's, yeah. I think, my advice to folks. Everybody has to do their part so we can move forward. Dr. Nandi, as always, thank you for that critical information. And if you have a coronavirus question for the doctor, you can always email him, Dr. Nandi at askdrnandi.com or send it to us on Facebook or Twitter.